What's up and what's happening? Today we are back at it again in the A model. Uh, but this is a different A model. Uh, I had a little bit of a situation. <laughs> um, I was going to exit the game and for whatever reason decided to click delete on my profile. So deleted the whole thing but we're back in business. Uh, as you can see money is doing fine. Evidently uh, my uh, level is back up. Got all that going right. Um, and yeah, decided that I would uh, buy a trailer. So I got the, the spread axle reefer here. Um, I think it's only a 48 foot actually, which is kind of weird, but I don't know. I wish that, uh, I could find a, like something to sort of clean up this back end a little bit. Like it just looks way too close to stock for me, but I don't know. The, the A model is definitely, uh, not the same as the one before, <laughs> as you can tell, uh, different fenders, I believe, different tank style. Different color, obviously, all that good stuff. Uh, interior's a little bit different too. Got the Seattle package dash looking sort of deal going on there. I think I actually had those uh, lollipop lights. But outside of that, just an old K dubs. Um, but yeah, plan is to put the old reefer to work, see what the A battle can do with it. First things first, gotta find some freight for it. All right, we got something little load of tires 35,000 pounds worth going over to Hobbs New Mexico might want to take that parking brake off but got that going over to the east side of New Mexico so that should be a good little trip kind of going away from uh, where I've been now when my profile reset I decided to put my first shop <laughs> I guess it's now my first shop decided to put that in Albuquerque so in a way, kind of still making that loop that I was talking about, but uh, now we're <laughs> kind of starting over, which isn't the end of the world or whatever, but kind of the, the way that she goes. I believe I even got the, the same engine in this new A model as I did before. 605 uh, Cummins in it, which sounds really nice. It sounds real old school. All the fun stuff, but... Yeah, the plan is to kind of make a, a shorter video than uh, what's normally out there. I don't know. I, I look at my own videos and I'm like, <laughs> I don't know who would want to waste this much time watching, you know, just this thing. So the plan is going forward to kind of make or try and make 10 to 15 minute long videos. So I guess we'll see how that works. But got 30 miles to kill now and then I will be at the shipper. So I will catch up with you all then. Alright, so just got down here to the shipper and it looks like they want us over on this alley on the left side. <laughs> so I uh, pulled in the wrong way completely. It should be a whole mess of fun to get this thing over there. Uh, I'm not sure if that's exactly how you're supposed to do it, blocking the road. It's kind of a bad idea, but we're going to give it our best shot here and see if we can't make it back there. All right. 
right, so they have finished loading us up, or loading us up, and uh, didn't exactly find the load that I came here originally for, but found one headed in a similar direction. So I'm gonna go ahead and potter along with that one. 250 miles to go. Uh, shouldn't take too long, <laughs> in theory. Uh, I guess I've never been out that way, so I don't exactly know uh, what's in store. And I don't know how the that last load was off the market so quick, because uh, I, I literally had to go down the road to get it. But, I don't know, I must have not been paying attention to the uh, expiration time on it. Don't be hitting that fence now. Don't hit the fence. There you go. Duck her off into the dirt here. But yeah, this truck sounds just as good as, as the other one in my opinion. Uh, she's something special. I think. I don't know. I, I like an old lady model. And just a, a cool look. Get a little outside noise for you here quick once. Get the jakes on just in case we gotta slow down or something. It sounds really mean when it gets up a little bit higher in the RPMs. And we're missing gears. Nice. Very nice. <clears throat> Turn jigs off, back in the cab. Anyways, but yeah, headed out from Albuquerque. I think the place that it's delivering is in Roswell. Uh, don't quote me on that, but it's what it seems like. Or what I can remember, anyways. Might just be uh, <laughs> thinking of some aliens crashing into the ground or whatever the deal was. There's something about that. But yeah, with my uh, profile getting reset, a lot of the preferences that I had for uh, how trucks shifted and uh, like the backup beeper came back, all that stuff, so. That was fun to have to go back and redo my own work. I also figured out that uh, if you put it on your turn signal uh, to make a right hand turn, they won't give you a red light violation. So that is good to know. Uh, so you don't have to wait for the whole dang light. I guess we're just gonna chug her up this hill here. Nice and easy does her. I'll, I'll show you what I'm talking about when you get up in those higher RPMs, it just screams. Just sounds like a banshee, you know what I mean? Just howling for it. I think we gotta stay in this land anyways, but yeah, normally I would try and keep a truck under 1500 RPMs just because that's a little more uh, realistic, but uh, not in this case, I guess. <laughs> it just sounds uh, a little too good to, you know, make it up and be like, oh, we gotta do it for fuel mileage. Whatever, you got a flat top with a reefer, you're not looking for fuel mileage. But anyways, we're going to be cruising for a bruising here for quite a while. So I will leave you all to the tunes and uh, kick back and enjoy the cruise.
right, so we're getting right up and close to uh, the destination here. Nice looking Pete off to the left. So that's good to see. Um, now knowing my luck, this thing, <laughs> yup. <laughs> uh, the dang, uh, oh wait, hold on. Maybe it's not off to the left. I was going to say, with knowing my luck, the place that I'm delivering is going to be off to the left and I just passed that guy and made a little bit of a um, rude move. Hold on, we got to zoom that John in, boy. Alright. Can't see anything. Um, Bitman, Bitman, Bitman. There it is. Alright, so it is on the right. Um, well, I'm going to cover that lane anyways. Just to... Just to make sure we can slide around in here. <clears throat> I think it's a good idea. That fence is, yeah, that fence is a little close on the, on the right there. Um, where do you want it, boss? Off to the right there. Okay, well, oh, maybe, <laughs> maybe should get a gear. There we go. I absolutely love the paint scheme on this truck now. Um, if you look back a couple videos, the old A model that I had. Uh, white, white and red, and uh, look real classy. But this just has like a a nice show truck look to it. Um, I don't know. What, actually, I don't think I messed with the breather lights at all. I, okay, yeah, they're perfect, anyways. <laughs> Why fix it isn't broken? But uh, I wish I could get a like a light blue stripe going on the trailer. But uh, actually, I don't think we're lined up with this. No, not at all. But Wish I could get that going on and uh, kind of complete the look, but as I said before, you can't exactly adjust these trailers too much. As you can see, you can get them all lit up, just like a Christmas tree, get them all lit up. But uh, as far as paint schemes go, kind of lacking. So I was looking for uh, a mod to kind of fix that problem, but I <laughs> kind of came up short a little bit I guess in a way more in my uh, skills of computers and such I'm not exactly the most tech savvy in the world but got my little brother he, he helps me out a lot with, with stuff like that so <laughs> good on him for that you know it kind of works most times but I guess this time wasn't exactly one of those times uh, just kind of <laughs> let it go for now all right, 10 grand on 251 miles. Boy, that'd be uh, nice to get some rates like that in real life. <laughs> no, that ain't happening at all. But anyways, yeah, I mean, just a classy looking truck overall. Uh, I mean, if I had to change anything about the truck, I'm not sure what I would change, you know? Uh, cab lights look nice, you know, all that, all that stuff. I guess maybe the, uh, the deck plate on the back, that'd be something that I'd like to change if I could but you can't always get what you want uh, I think I got a different bumper on it from the last one too but I'm sure there's a lot of stuff that's different from it that I'm just not noticing but anyhow that would be a uh, little video for the day nice little cruise in the K dubs uh, interesting little situation with the trailer uh, in all honesty I bought the trailer just to see what it would look like <laughs> Uh, you know, kind of get a, a real deal old school, classy, coast to coast looking, uh, you know, produce hauler type deal going on. And, uh, I think I did all right on that. Not, not too bad. She, she's a classy girl, but yeah, I guess, uh, that would wrap up this video and I appreciate you riding with me on this one and I'm gonna catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.